Hello everyone, my name is Mohammed, and I am the lead maintainer and developer for the Ask for Summary Moodle plugin. In this video, I'll be showing you how to use Ask for Summary, some of its features, and how to ask a question. Before we get into any technical features, what is Ask for Summary? Ask for Summary is a question and answer service for your course. You can ask a question and the plugin will try and answer you based on your course material. So how exactly is a question asked? You will see a block on the right hand side of your course page, or wherever your blocks are usually located. You will see some settings contained in the block. Firstly, make sure that Ask for Summary is enabled. This will confirm that your question will be considered. Then, look for the helper name and the response type slash form. Head to that form, or whatever form you have access to if it is set to all forums. Once you've found the designated forum, click Add a New Discussion Topic. Once you've began to create a new discussion topic, you will have two choices to trigger Ask for Summary to register your question. You can either make the subject of your message high than the helper name exactly, or you can include high than the helper name in the beginning of your message. Once your question is complete, hit Post a Form. Once you submit your question, Check back later and see if the plugin has responded. It should be a direct reply to your form post. If you'd like to ask another question, you can reply to any post with your question beginning the same way, or if you chose to make the subject name, hi helper name, you can just ask another question. With that, I'd like to thank you for watching and taking the time to try out Ask for Summary, the question and answer service for courses.